John, we were just talking about this image. This is one of the ones you came back from Death Valley in the Alabama Hills. It was one of your favorites. And mm -hmm. um, I just wanted to give you a few pointers because I think there's a couple of things that would make this image stronger. Oh. What you really should do is increase the contrast, first of all. And I wouldn't do it globally. I'd do it through dodging and burning up in the skies. And then this foreground area is a little bit too distracting. It's not really, especially on the left, you don't want your eye to be going there. So I would tamp that down a bit with some burning and then uh, some highlight enhancement on those mountains and snow area over hey, in the hey, right. Hey, hey, Cole. Yeah. I don't remember asking for your opinion. Well, John, this would make your image a lot better. Uh, it was, Accor it, according to whom? To me, the only person who matters. <laughs> uh, Cole. Now I'm sharing my vision on John's image. And that's a real no no. <laughs> oh my God. Besides, I, I thought, besides I thought you were serious. That was a big setup, folks. He said, pull that image up and show it. I'm like, why? What, what do you. John's vision is going to be different than mine. And so getting my opinion is absolutely worthless because that may not be the way John sees that image. In fact, I'm pretty certain he and I would see it differently. Uh, yeah. So, because we did talk about feedback before in a previous episode, but this is a little different than that, isn't it? This is that unsolicited <laughs> feedback that we can sometimes get, or or even more specific this time. This is, hey, here's my opinion of what you should, and here you are using those should words again, and man, does that make my skin crawl. What do you mean I should? Well, would it be any different that if you came to me and said, hey, Cole, Look at this image. What would you do to it? Yeah. Uh, what should no, a person's that, response be? Well, be just what you said. You you just said what you'd probably, if I did that, you would have given that same feedback. Although well, I, I know you well enough that you wouldn't. No. Yeah. I, I'd say, John, what do you think of that image? Yeah. What do you like about it? What don't you like about it? How can you take those things you like, make them stronger? How can you take those things you don't like and kind of, diminish them a bit yeah. but what can you what's your vision for this image yeah and that's okay. that's a i love that we've pivoted in this episode to that because as you know from working together in the field i just don't like the you shoulds i you know you might consider uh is a much softer way and it's also not it's not making it so clearly that you feel that that's what this person should do to make it better. Make it better to who? To the person giving the feedback. That's about it. But you're right. I mean, when asked about, you know, so when somebody else comes to you, I think it's a much better thing to help them through the process of refining their own work, not tell them what they should do. Now, we recently had a friend, Vince, who yep. said, here's what I my vision is. Here's what I want to do. How can I go about doing that? And I felt a little better about suggesting some things because it wasn't saying what he should, how he should see it. He already saw it. Yes. He just didn't know how to execute it. Yeah. And I think we just go ahead. No, you go ahead. No, no, you go. No, no, you go ahead. You go. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> No, I had I, an image once that I couldn't get right. I knew what I wanted. It was my iceberg, my favorite iceberg, uh, but I couldn't do a long exposure. And I was asking a friend and he gave me a tip on how to turn it into a long exposure. Uh, I think that's very appropriate to ask other people, how can I do this? I know what I want. How can I do it? That's much different than, I don't know what to do with this image. What should I do, John? Very different. Very, Very different. To me, you you just pretty much summarized what I was going to chime in and say. To oh, me, sure, sure, you were about to say yeah, that. I, I, I really was. I was going to say it's very different to say, and that's essentially what I'm trying to do in the field and you're trying to do is we're trying to say that when somebody says we want your opinion, John or Cole, it's much better for us to say, well, tell me what you're trying to do. You know, then I can at least give and and, and to go back to Vince's image today. He, he knew exactly where he wanted the light to be there. He liked this part of it. He liked this part. He just wasn't sure is that distracting. That's a very different question at that point. And now you can say, well, why don't you try? I still like that idea. 
why don't you try, you know, cropping some of the left off is what we told him. And then he'll decide. We're not going to say, yes, I like it better this way or that way. Why don't you try that? And then you decide whether it works this way or that way, A or B. I, I always like to ask the person first, you know, how do they feel about it? And what are their strengths? What are the weaknesses? To see if they really have a feeling for that image yeah. or they're just kind of flopping around, hoping to stumble upon something great. Yeah. And that's, that's, that's not the way you want to do it, right? You want to have intent, I think. I think so. Yeah. Good. Well, I like it. Thanks for ripping my image to shreds. Now I feel like I shouldn't <laughs> even post that one. I'm going to go pull it off of Instagram because you think it needs to be darkened here and lightened over here. Can you actually pull an image off Instagram? Absolutely. You can go. John, that post. let's hang up and you get to work. <laughs> no, well, you talk nice, about, talk about nice now image. I have FUD, fears, uncertainties, and doubts about my work, all because you're trying to be funny. And I, now I'm wondering if you're being serious. But it's 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 at your expense, John. Well, it's always at my expense, yeah. Cole. I've yet to do anything that causes your, your feelings. You know why? You don't have, you have to have feelings to have them be hurt. <laughs> so, oh my gosh. Okay. Hey, let's do the whole thing now. It's your turn. What did they have to do? Subscribe, hit that button again and hit the little bell so that you'll get a notice of when the next episode's coming out. Because it's really critical that our numbers go up. Up. Right? Yes, oh, we yeah. them to go up. We were confused for a while. We thought the lower the number, the better. But someone straightened us out. <laughs> All right. Hey. Okay. It's uh, it's good to be seen, Cole. Good to be seen. Change your shirt next time. I, I'm going to change my shirt. Okay. Take See care, folks. Merry Bye. Christmas. <laughs>